Remember those nifty coils your bandsaw blades were in when you bought them? You know, the ones that you can't get them into anymore? Well, we're going to show you how. It's actually very simple once you see it happen a time or two. This is how you do it. We'll break it down in the steps in a minute, but I just wanted you to see how easy this actually is. And that's all there is to it. And it's back in that nifty little coil. With the teeth facing away from us, we lightly step on the blade to hold it down. I put it on a piece of wood rather than a concrete so we don't mess up the teeth. Back at the top, we turn our hand around so it's palm out, and then give it a full turn as we push the blade down. When you get down towards your foot, the blade will be in the coils, but kind of loosely, so you have to gather them up. I'll usually lift my foot a little bit so I can get a better grip on all of the coils. Then you can carefully work the coils and they'll equalize so they're all about the same size. I secure the coils with three wire ties like you get off of a loaf of bread. Applying those ties is very quick and the blade stays secure so you don't open a drawer and it springs out at you. All you really need to do is wrap that tie around the blade two or three times and it'll stay put. And that's really all there is to it. The blade's back in a nice compact package that makes it easier to store. The safest way to uncoil it is even easier. Just toss it out on the lawn and then go get it when it quits rolling around.